Parametric CAD is the most common design tool used by engineers since it allows them to iterate over design parameters to find better solutions and incorporates fabrication-aware constraints. Databases of 3D models that represent these objects are easy to find. However, their CAD representation is often unavailable. These 3D models contain no semantic information about the procedures by which they were created. This makes both understanding the part's design rationale and editing the mesh challenging. In this work, we propose a method for automatically generating a CSG tree from an input 3D mesh. Our approach is based on the realization that CSG is simply a class of computer programs. Therefore, our method amounts to automatic code generation from specifications, which is the problem program synthesis techniques have been successful at solving over the last few years. Our method begins by extracting a discrete set of fixed parameter candidate primitives to consider, transforming the problem into a discrete search. We employ a sampling technique which allows us to tractably verify program correctness by checking only a small set of points. The primitives and sample points drive a constraint-based program synthesizer which outputs a candidate CSG tree. If the synthesizer ever fails in producing a correct CSG tree, our algorithm repartitions the input geometry into smaller, more manageable segments and repeats the search. Our full pipeline provides a complete, efficient, and scalable search. We built a dataset of 45 CAD models of varying complexity, with the most complex one having over 100 primitives. Our scalable method can solve all examples and generates compact CSG trees. For example, this mechanical part, composed of 57 solid primitives, was inferred in less than 17 minutes. Our robust algorithm is able to generate CSG trees for noisy input. This example shows reconstructed results for an input mesh with perturbations of different magnitudes. Our robust primitive detection allows us to generate results made from solid primitives not included in our language, such as Tori. Our method can handle missing surface primitives this example shows how the resulting reconstruction improves with the number of inputs, but how the method can still generate good approximations when the number of input primitives is bounded. Here are some additional results. 